All right, check it out. Autofocus on the D5100. If you press your info button, it'll bring up this view. Press it again, it'll allow you to change the settings. If you go into basically the halfway down, there's the, your autofocus mode. You have auto servo, single servo, continuous servo, and manual focus. Um, once you set your focus mode, if you go one more down, you have your area mode. Um, this isn't a good example because there's only two options, single point and auto area. But if you choose one of the other ones, for instance, auto, you have four different area modes. Uh, you have your auto, 3D tracking, dynamic area, and single point. One thing to note about single point, which I'll show better in a different video, is that once you half press your shutter, over here on the bottom left, you, you notice that I can change where that little box is. And that is telling the camera which autofocus point to use. And now remember, we're on single point autofocus mode. If we were on um, a dynamic or 3D tracking or auto, we wouldn't have that option. It would use all of the autofocus points. So we can't change that. So that's autofocus on the D5100. Check out the other videos for some more specific, uh, some more specifics on the autofocus area mode. I'm Adam with Camera Guides and this is brought to you by Stock Coto. Thanks for watching.